Smoke a purse so sweet with Hot Thoughts TV. Y'all know what the fuck we doing, man. It's Hot Thoughts TV. Niggas hot in the beach, man. I'm smoking a purse so sweet with Hot Thoughts TV. From there, uh, what did y'all's relationship grow? You know, I, I know you know you part of the OVO sound. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, you know, I was the first first person to, to have OVO name. A lot of oh, people yeah. don't even know that. I was OVO OG Ron C first. Before you seen all them other OVO this, OVO that. The kid was first. Drake gave me that name, personally. Mm -hmm. He the one said, you are now OVO G Ron C. Mm -hmm. That's hard. Yeah, texted it, texted it, tweeted it. You know, once he tweeted it, that's why I ain't never, that's why if you go to all my shit and say OVO G Ron C, I ain't never changed it. He gave me that name. Yeah. And uh, what was the first tape or song or interaction you had when you worked with his music? Uh, Houston can thank us later. Houston can Houston can thank us. Houston thank me now, right? Yeah. No, it was uh, called thank, thank me, me now. Uh, okay, okay. It was called thank me now or thank, thank me later. Thank me later. I, I believe you talking about the album. Yeah, it's called thank, thank me later. Thank me later. Yeah. Okay, well, so we call ours. Houston can thank me later. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, so that was it. We did the, the remix to Thank Me Later, and we said, yeah, we said, Houston can thank me later. Yeah, so, yeah, we, yeah. yeah, we did the chopper. That was the first one. Because Mr. Rogers, he was a chop star at this time. This is the first one me and Counselor did. Mr. Rogers did So Far Gone. Mm -hmm. But he was a chop star at the time, though, when he did that. I think so, right, Rogers? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, and, um, so from from there, Chop Stars is is how one how does someone become a Chop Star? For all the people aspiring, all the DJs aspiring, you know, I not too long ago I seen y'all had my boy Izzy to the group. Shout out to Izzy. So uh, hey, just uh, for the uh, aspiring people, how do they how would they go about you know catching well, your eye? Well now, <clears throat> now back then I, I never wanted I, this wasn't supposed to be a group. It wasn't. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it just turned out, you know, God, you know, turned out this, you know, what it is and how it ended up being this way because I started running into, you know, the DJs like Izzy's who, whose concern was keeping, you know, DJ Screw's legacy alive. They was into, you know, they they want, you know, chop screw it too, you know what I'm saying? So I just started collecting them all and just mentoring them basically, you know, and it turned into, you know, uh, just the brand just got real strong. And you know here we are, but for those that you know, like for moving forward, like for the recruitment, when we did recruit, like we would just recruit, try the people that was you know one understood about keeping a legacy going, two, see we all about the independent. See when we find all these artists that we chop and screw now, when we do them not, we, we was down with them when they was nothing. So now nah, that's why they we chop and screw their stuff. That's why we yeah. chop and screw Don Tyler. That's why we chop and screw Travis Scott. That's why we can chop and screw these guys because they were nothing when we got down with them. All these guys, you know what I'm saying? So that was our that's that was our claim to fame is how we got you know here and came in quick was because we messed with it, you know. The artists from the the, the, the get go. So like now when we get ready to do, we get ready to have a new recruit. So we basically look for artists who's trying to. That's what they do. Like we don't need nobody trying to come in and chop up Drake. Yeah. Chop up Future. We are them are our relationships already. We don't need you to do that. We don't need you to come in and be competition to us. You can stay outside to be competition. <laughs> Still be outside to right. get what you get. Yeah. You know what I'm saying out there. But we already got it covered for us. All that. Who got the new? You go. Who we need the DJs who's gonna find a new NBA young boys, the next Don Tyler's, the next Drake's, the next. Tr That's who we're recruiting for. You know what I'm saying? We're not recruiting for because you you got you know it's good to have good skills, but the main purpose of us is we are for the independence. So if you're not for the independence, then like we just, you know we don't really want it. We, right. we don't we don't need no comp we don't we don't need no help doing the other stuff. It's the independent art and every DJ know at least ten ten independent art. If you don't, then you just the disc jockey. <laughs> you just spinning records. 